In this quick tips video, we're going to be looking at how to remove a background using a couple different methods inside of Rebel 5. So what we're going to do is we're going to start by pasting a picture with a white background onto the screen. All right, so we're going to move this elephant and we're going to use shift to lock the aspect and we're going to grow him a little bit larger. Here we're going to put him up here and now you can see the grass in the background is not showing because we have the elephant right here on a white background. So we're going to go to filter, but we're going to click OK or hit the enter key here, filter, white to alpha. And you'll notice that this has immediately removed the background here. And now if we want, we can create a duplicate layer. Move this in front of the elephant and we've got a little bit of depth here. All right, so using white to alpha, black to alpha will obviously do the opposite of this. This does pull white from the actual image. So if we paint here behind the eye, you can see that the white in the eye has been changed into transparent. So keep that in mind. Okay, so now let's look at another type of image. And let's remove right here from the background. Now, if you're doing something like this and you need to make sure that this is not transparent, because if you look at this image right here, the elephant, and we move him down, you can see that we can see through him a little bit. So what we can do here is we can control click the elephant right here, this little square, which will select everything. And then what we can do is we can create a new layer. Let's put this layer on top of right now and let's fill this using white. Okay, now if we move this layer underneath and we merge these two layers, which is control E, now we have an elephant that if we bring it in front, it's not going to have any transparency. Let's go ahead and deselect. Now we have our elephant and our elephant has a non-transparent white eye and we can move it around and we don't have to erase the background in order to get that elephant to be uh, without a background, a beautiful clean mapping around the outside edge, and that works really well. Here we're gonna look at that same image using the magic wand. Let's make the canvas color blue so we can see what's happening easier. So now with layer two selected, our elephant, we're going to use the magic wand tool. We're gonna to tap on the white section on the outside on a image where the background color is fairly simple you may be able to do a magic wand selection like this and grab everything and then hit the delete key. And that's gonna do a really good job. Notice that the whites of the eyes have stayed. We have this little section over here. So let's use the magic wand tool here, select and remove that there. All right, now with a few less steps, we've accomplished the same thing as we did with the white to alpha. Now there's one other method that I think we're largely familiar with, if we want to remove something like a background, we can also use the freehand selection tool. So that looks like this. We're going to remove just a section right here. I'm going to hit delete and that's going to remove that section. Now, if we have a selection right here, if we want to add to it, we can use the shift key and add that selection in. If we want to remove from that selection, we can use the Alt key and cut into that that way. Hit the Delete key again and you can refine your selection that way. That's how to remove a background with multiple methods inside of Rebel 5. In the next video, we're going to be looking at how to create drips using our wet media. So stay tuned for that.